I am a beautiful wild Pokemon right now. good their vacuums work here oh hello i'm victoria rose kind of the the outcast of, of youtube i it, i try to make it look like a kindergartner cut my bangs okay it's intentional in case you wondered who i was that's me i'm doing something really exciting today i've been doing quite a few cool i've been doing cool things here and there haven't really felt that they were full video worthy but today's video is full video worthy i've been going to Rapongi and going to the gym there after i went to the gym hapsic took me to this really cool place in Rapongi where they have cool little light shows and stuff which is really cool just free for the viewing and then they have these little booths it was really nice in this like tunnel where you could just put your feet in water cool i, I didn't want to do it because i don't want to put my feet where other people are putting their feet in the water no thanks. I don't like feet, by the way. <laughs> That's like a, a thing about me. Anyways, oh, and then yesterday I was kind of having a low day, to be honest. I was alone. I slept through like the whole day because I was so tired because I hadn't slept the other day. And I'm just, so I just started walking around the area that I'm in right now where this apartment's at, which is Zoshigaya. I went to a polar bear cafe. I didn't know, I just thought it was like about polar bears or a themed cafe like that, but it's actually like an anime. So I went in there and got some coffee. Everything was really cute, but I was boring. And also lately, you guys have been seeing the content that I've been making. It's kind of like I've been eating um, not the best stuff. So I didn't want to have um, any snacks or anything there because it was just like, mm. uh, I was on a Japanese comedian's YouTube channel. I'll put a little clip right here of that. I was just like walking to the gym. And he saw me. <laughs> so, like, it was really hard to understand what was going on. I still have no idea. But uh, that's for your viewing pleasure. Los Angeles. Today we're visiting the Pokemon Cafe. It's not a secret. You saw it in the title. So first I'm going to review Japanese vacuum because my content makes a lot of sense. So let's just put this at the worst angle possible. Yeah. Ugh. Watch me drop it everywhere. Because that is something I would do. Yeah, I don't read instruction manual. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I put too far the wrong part. By the way, yes, my garbage desperately needs to be emptied, but I don't know. Oh, okay, cool. That was anticlimactic. A little fluff ball came out, so content you subscribe for. Hey, you're not paying for it, unless you're a channel member that I appreciate you. I'm sorry that I have been neglecting you. <laughs> okay, um, let's go to this Pokemon Cafe. All I know about it is that it is completely Pokemon themed. I think they have veggie burgers there. I hope so. We're gonna get some Pokemon themed stuff and I'm definitely gonna get coffee there. So let's go to the Pokemon Cafe. Oh, backstory, I really like Pokemon. That's why I'm going, I think it's really cool. Um, out of all the type of anime stuff, I don't know much about anime. I am in Japan and I don't love anime, I'm sorry. But I do love Pokemon, it's something very universal I feel like. <laughs> Thanks for being a subscriber. Oh, subscribe and like. Okay, so I made it to the place, I think. Now I'm just gonna wait for Haptic. The stations here are huge and they're really easy to get lost in. And it's really confusing to meet up with people sometimes because of them, but I think that the Pokemon Cafe is in the station somewhere. I don't even think this is a station actually. I think this is just a department store and the station just comes up into it. I don't know. Go to the Pokemon What's Center. What's your favorite Pokemon? It's the horse one with the flaming tail. What? We realized that there's a Pokemon Center close to here, so we're gonna go in there first and see what that's all about. We realized that, that big black building, like... Do you want to be seen as an asshole on my YouTube all the time? I'm not an asshole. Asshole. <laughs> asshole. Arsehole? 
This is the Pokemon Center. Pokemon! Gotta catch them! You teach me and I'll teach you. <laughs> I didn't know you had to make reservations online. Blame it on anxiety or what you will, but it overwhelms me to research things too much, so I always just kind of half plan things, and it turns out like this. But this is the Pokemon Center. This place is never ending, but um, yeah, so can't get into the cafe, which I'm super mad about, but it's also expensive. But yeah, I didn't come to Japan, not one of the people that are into all this type of stuff, and the people that do come here probably pre-plan it like months in advance because they're so excited about it and I kind of just go and do things and don't think about it. So I guess you have to make a reservation. Oh, I'm just mad, I'm just mad. Despite not being able to actually go into the cafe, this is kind of the general menu of what we could have had uh, had I planned better, but I did sneak a peek inside and it looked pretty cool from what I could see, but I don't know how cool it actually was. In my defense, they were booked an entire month prior, so. So I'm trying to make, figure out how to make the best of the situation considering I came all the way here to go to the cafe. I'm trying to think of a cheap way to make this worth this video, but for now, I'm finding the bathroom. I don't know. I'm, I'm mad, I get mad about these things, but I shouldn't be. I just need to be resourceful. I wanna experience something Pokemon related. Aside from PMSing and uh, the cafe disappointment, my eyelash tried to fall off and I'm like, hey, no, not today, gotcha. Uh, quality content. Quality content you subscribe for, right? Subscribe and like, yeah. Okay, can, can you do me? When's, when's the next plan? Stop, I'm over it. <laughs> when's the next available reservation? When's the next available reservation? Okay, so the new idea is that I would have to spend like $50 in there because you have to buy a drink and a meal. And since I can't make a reservation and I can't go in there, fuck that. So we're going to go to the Pokemon Center and buy two different Pokemons. Sorry. <laughs> and battle them in a 360 video instead. I think that's cooler than going to a dumb cafe where you're just going to poop all, all the food out all in it. We're gonna try and find the cheapest Pokemon. Listen, we're gonna find the cheapest Pokemon. Not this one, this is probably $50. What do you think, Haptic? I think you're PMSing hardcore. I'm PMSing. <laughs> <laughs> just for a tantrum. Yeah, I threw a tantrum because my camera got stuck on me and I had like so much stuff on me all the time I couldn't get it off. But so, comment below your favorite Pokemon. Let's go catch them. Yeah, this, this one. Am I might wait, kid. I think this one might win. <laughs> you think so? Yeah. Right, well, I have to choose my Pokemon. Where's the one that I like? inside of them and we don't know what they are. So we're both just going to choose one. The Pokemon chooses us and we'll battle them. So go ahead, choose your ball. Yeah. This one. Is that the one? That's the one. Alright, it's my turn. I'm going to choose my Pokemon. Oh, this one's, this one's not great. Uh, I feel good about this one. How much do you think it's going to be, guys? Yeah, comment below. You'll know soon enough. <laughs> so, you can show you in. Papa, look at you. Yeah. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
860. 860? Yeah. Okay. I don't want to seem like a poser. Look at all these people around here, they actually like, look like they're in the Pokemon. Yeah, you need to like integrate. <laughs> you guys should do that. Yeah. Alicia. What? Should I get it? It's $5. I think it's a piece of bread. <laughs> <gasps> Speaking to my British. Nah. Look, this could go in my sushi making. They're little sushi seaweeds. I'm gonna get that. Oh yeah, it's got a little, you pop it out. Yeah. I could, we can make our own little cafe. Oh, by the way, Emmy. <laughs> Why you look like that? This. Oh, thank you. Arigato. I got a weird leaf thing. Okay, so we're finally out of the Pokemon Center. Got our goods. Um, we're really hungry, and we didn't get food because obviously we couldn't go to the cafe. So I know that there is a vegan ramen place close by. If haptic is down for vegan ramen. Uh, this is the options here. This is the only like vegan ramen place I know of. Okay, so maybe we couldn't get into the actual Pokemon Cafe, but I can still eat Pokemon and get this really cool card that's flashy. I lost it, but it's still cool. So for this recipe, all you gotta do is punch out your Pokemon and put it on your ramen and you got Poke Ramen. I think this is probably intended for a kid's lunch because Japanese moms put in a ton of effort to make their kid's lunches extra kawaii. But it worked for my ramen, so that made me happy. There you have it. Pokemon. <laughs> Let's see what your destiny holds. You first. You go first. You're a weird sheep thing. What's you, you should figure out its name and its abilities. Oh man. What's Snorlax? Cool. Take your baby home. We're gonna battle with it later. I spent way too much money on this for you not to love it. Take your sheep. Train it. Hold it. Be kind and loving to it, but firm when you need to. Good luck. Bye. I'll, I'll battle you later. I'll, I'll make it faint. No! Not right now. One of the best parts about Tokyo was walking at night. It's actually really soothing and nice and you don't ever feel in danger here. Okay, I am back home. I was trying to give you guys a full Pokemon experience even though I'm sorry that we didn't get to go directly into an order from the cafe. I calculated everything I would have spent at the cafe and I spent ended up spending less than I would have spent at the cafe. We got vegan ramen and I even got the little soy meat along with it and I got a face mask. I made my vegan ramen Pokemon ramen so that counts for something doesn't it? And now I'm gonna have my face mask and we got our battling Pokeballs. All right let me just wash my face. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know what this Pokemon's name is. It has like ears. Like where are the ears supposed to go? Guess the ears will just go into my hair. <laughs> no pig. There we go. I'm a now a Pokemon. I look like a pig. 
<laughs> just looks like maybe it is a pig. I don't know. I just look like a piggy. Gotta catch them all. Don't forget to catch this one. <laughs> yeah, I'm a Pokemon. I am a beautiful wild Pokemon right now. All right, thank you so much for watching this crazy messed up vlog. I'm sorry everything was a fail, but I hope it was still entertaining. I hope you still had a good time with me. Have an amazing day. I will see you in the next vlog. I love you very much. Stay up to date because this apartment that I'm in right now, I have to move soon. Yes, it's already been like nearly a month that I've been here. Ugh. Bye guys, I love you very much. Psst. Hey, thanks for watching till the very, very end. That's cool.